Okay, so I kind of did a thing. Earlier today, I met up with Steenfot Aquatics, who was going to be handing off some turtles to me. Now, for a little background, I did not think I was going to get more turtles for a while after the passing of Nemo. An opportunity presented itself. Basically, Bob needed someone to take the turtles since he's having to redo his fish room. So thank you for trusting me with them. Um, the audio in the parking lot was really bad, so that's why you're getting a voiceover. But I know you guys are excited to meet the turtles, so let's get to it. So here are the newest additions to the family and you might be like those look like sushi takeout containers and you would be absolutely correct these are from Trapper Sushi because I love sushi but it's what's inside these that is important so I forgot to do my whole intro because I'm super excited so we'll do it now <laughs> what is up guys it is the turtle girl welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel let me introduce to you the musk turtle clan Okay, I'm kind of freaking out because these guys are super duper cute. You can see how small they are. And they're kind of mad at me, so I'm gonna put them back. So, they are musk turtles, common musk turtles, Sternotheris odoratus, because if they're scared, they will make the smell. This is a species I have wanted to have. And so there are actually six turtles in here. And of those six, there are two females and four males. And all of them but one are actually blind or have one eye, some kind of disability with vision. This one here is a female and it has one good eye. This one I've decided to name Fury, like Nick Fury, although it's probably Nicole Fury because this is a girl. So she's gonna go in here. And then we've got Toph, because Toph Beifong from Avatar The Last Airbender. I mean, seriously, what's with you people? I'm blind! This little gal is gonna be Toph because although she does have two eyes, I don't know that she has visibility, so. That's her. Now you guys are probably wondering how I'm gonna tell them apart. I don't know how I will, but I will somehow. So, this one as you can see, he is completely blind, he has no eyes. Kinda, kinda wild like that, and super small. So I've decided to name this one Crash, because he'll crash around the tank. And then let me bring you up close for these other three. Kind of sticking with the blind names, you can see here's the other three. So there was three and three in here. I put them in the paper towel and they just have the drilled holes to give them aeration during transit. But we have three other males. And so the other three names that I've got are Elon, because you know, Elon Musk. So like, I would be losing an opportunity if I didn't name one of them Elon. All right, let's go. There goes that little guy. The other name that I chose was Chirrut, like Chirrut Imwe from Star Wars Rogue One. He was the blind guardian of the wills. Whoa, easy buddy. Look at him. And then again, keeping with the blindness, this last one is going to be Murdoch, like from Daredevil. And there he goes. Look at him cruising around in there. And as you guys can see, the tank water level, I actually lowered it a couple inches just to make sure that the water depth is not too deep for them. So right now it's more at like 18 inches instead of like a good 24. So that way they don't have to swim as high to the top. We'll see how they like that. Look at them, they're already all crawling around down here. And then we've got a basking area over here for them that I set up. As you can see, I moved the lights so that they're over on this side. And then if you saw the last video, you saw that I did add some plants. Some of the Valisneria up here actually just, I was hoping it would root, but it somehow got uprooted. So I don't know what was going on there. So I ended up just taking that out. But there is still the big jungle Val back there in the corner. Oh, and here comes one. Oh, and he knocked out the log that I've been trying to sink. Come on, man. Oh, look at them. They're just cruising around here. They're so cute. So now we have six little turtles cruising around this tank, which I'm very excited about. I think it'll be good for me to not just have an empty tank to stare at and be sad about. But now these little guys all have a home, obviously. Oh, look at him getting his water up there. Oh, look at this one. Hello. And so the way I know the males from the females is that you can see the males have significantly larger tails. Like you see that really big tail right there? That's a male. And then over here, you can see both of these have tiny, tiny little tails. Those are females. So I think it'll be interesting to see how they learn how to navigate this place with limited vision. Look at them. Their little butts are so cute. 
Oh my gosh. Ah, you're so small. This is Fury and this is Toph, I think. Yeah, this is Toph right here. Hi, Toph. Toph Beifong, Earthbender. Oh, look at this one. Hello, I think that's Cheerit. I don't know. They, I'm, I don't think I'll be able to actually keep track of that. Oh no, wait. Yeah, this is Cheerit, I think. Maybe, hello. Oh my gosh, you guys, they're so cute! It's very interesting to already see how their behavior is so different from that of Nemo. Like, I can definitely tell they're exploring more down here at the bottom, bottom walkers, if you will, rather than swimming in the center of the tank. So I actually bought them some sinking pellets. So let's try those out now. There it goes. A bunch of pellets. Oh, it's coming in the rocks back there. Oh, maybe they'll smell it. Do you smell it, buddy? Going the wrong way. Food's over here. Let me see if I can drop some over here by this herd. We gotta come up with a name for this group of turtles, you guys. Like, you know, it's, is it like a herd of turtles? I think I like the, the term herd, but like, I don't know, they just need a, a name, like a gang name. Is that stupid? I don't know, let's see. Oh, 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 they smell it, they smell it. Maybe I don't need to throw in more. Come on, guys, the food's this way. Oh, starting to find some. Right here, right here, come on, buddy. Oh, yes, good job. Good job, little buddy. I've also noticed that the females have these really pretty patterns on the top of their heads, whereas the males are kind of just plain. Oh, here comes the blind one. Come on, buddy. I think this one's Crash, I don't know. Or is it Murdoch? Oh, look at them, they're all eating over here. Chow down time, good job. I'm so proud, look at him. Even this blind one over here has got something to chew on. Look at him, he's just smelling for it. Oh, this one got one. Oh yeah, right there, bud, good job. And because they have the sand, they're actually able to kind of sift through and spit out what's not good for them. Yeah, right there by your face, right there by your face. Oh, he's pushing him out of the way. Come on now, man. Oh, look at him. Crashing into each other. This little guy over here has got all his whole own corner. I think I should drop in some more. Now I know what some of you might be thinking. Soul, isn't that overstocked? By the way, Soul is my name in case you guys didn't know. I feel like I should mention it more often because I shared it in a Q&A, but people always still ask me my name and like, I go by the turtle girl. But anyway, you might be wondering, isn't that overstocked? Six turtles, 75 gallon tank, you probably only have about 60 gallons of water in there. And I will say, while that is true, these turtles are extremely small when compared to Nemo. Now they are juvenile, so they might get a little bit bigger than this, but I don't anticipate them getting much bigger because these musk turtles tend to stay under four inches anyway. And these are of the mini variety. Basically they've been bred to have the trait of growing smaller. So those are my new babies. I am so, so excited to have some life in this tank again. Please subscribe if you want to see more of these cuties. I'm so excited because this is a species I haven't owned before So I'll be learning some new things and hopefully along the way sharing some of that with you So hit the thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I will see you all next Friday. Have a totally awesome day. Bye-bye